Sharon aka Wabaraka here. I am on my way to just one of my tours in the UK honestly. Um, I love touring around, it's a weekend and we just decided to go for a trip out. I just wanted to show you um, what normally happens around winter time here in the UK. Notice how all the trees, they've shed leaves. See, all, all these trees, they don't have any leaves on them. And this is because obviously they fell during fall. So we're coming into spring soon, around April time, it's gonna be um, spring. And what you'll notice is that the trees will start having flowers, small flowers, and then get back their leaves again. And it's going to look beautiful and uh, glorious as opposed to how it looks right now which is really gloomy and in addition there's a storm the so the don't exit. even make it really really nice but hey that's what we get um so yeah that's what i wanted to show you guys join me i'll show you where we are going to in a bit i'll be back the at the fourth exit. now the, the, the mountains, the hills, how beautiful it is. I know it's it's a bit dull where you go. Uh, but it's a it's uh, hilly and beautiful. The countryside is really really lovely. And uh, although it's very windy, and I guess all this wind is coming from those mountains, so I have to drive very slowly and very carefully. I can ask you to go to my gosh. You know, no, no, watch a meeting as in a flower, as in a the, the leaves, they shed off. But it's a funny thing in there around April time, as it can grow. So you see the difference. And even how it looks dull right now, when, when spring comes, at least it's brighter. Kwang is so dull like it is right now. Kuna Kwanga a little bit warmer and better. Although this is the UK, this is a magic Kuna Kwanga na Joto Sahara. It's when you get it, you get it. When you're lucky. Kuna some other trees, they don't shed their leaves. Those ones they have leaves throughout the year. But majority of them is the the flowers or their leaves. around here the countryside 